Good evening from Yami B TV. I um, hope you're all happy and celebrating um, another great escape by England. But hey, who knows? Their name might be on the trophy. Um, but more on that maybe later on in the live or tomorrow, right? Um, but breaking news in the last couple of days and after 25, 26, 27 years, of all um, the back and forth stuff between two of those men, I suppose I consider as friends. Um, can you believe that they have met? What happened? I'm not gonna go into the mayhem, all right? But whose fault is it that Kevin Lane and Roger Vinson meet after all those years, after all, it's written in Kevin's late, Kevin Lane's book, the Cat A's were aware of the differences they had with each other for 20 years in those category A's. They were never allowed to meet. What happens? Once coming down in category from his life sentence. One has been unjustly recalled and proved to be, again, fate, luck, all the authorities. Which one? That one gets on a bus and they end up in the same prison as each other. What does it all mean? Right. Probation. Um, the whole world have listened to young Kevin saying his peace on the outside. Roger Vinson has to listen from the inside or be told about what's being said on the outside. Um, all the authorities are aware of that. Two massive names from that shit life, right? <laughs> what an absolute nightmare. Bloody hell. So, do we think that maybe they put them together on purpose? I'm thinking you could never do that. Why would you want to do that? To what have you got against both? Kevin feels unjustly um, treated for his case. Roger Vincent denies any such thing was his fault or anything like that. Um, not allowed to have given his account yet. But talking about when I was in the category A's, um, everybody knew. Everybody knew that if they ever saw each other, it might just go off. Not even might. It has to. One feels fucking... Like, absolutely, you know what I mean? That my name has been tarnished. The other feels like he spent his whole life in prison for something he didn't do. What what would you expect to happen? What would normally happen? Is their names, no, how it is fact, their names are already on paper that they're not allowed to see each other. So it would have happened in the cats, right? How has it happened in a cat C? Because maybe they're lackadaisical. Maybe, but then the other things that you're asking me, well, then how can the one that's getting there not know that the other one's there and why not just back out of it, da 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 Can't say which way round it was. Um, but maybe they've lost track of each other. Because <laughs> they're so used to keeping. My days, when will it ever end? What does it do to both parties? One, looking... It's been re re showed re rehabilitation, Roger, to get to where he's at now, right? And about to probably get to open conditions, yeah? And get ready for normality on the outside. One has just got a case dismissed and doesn't want to be in there and wants to get out as soon as possible. What does it all do now? What it does do is that they're going to want to cover their tracks, their authorities, right? How do they do that? 
or how do they both get to where they want to get to? You know, having had enough of prison and that life. Has this, again, set the catalyst, the cat amongst the pigeons, that this is what happens, is going to happen? No, we are hoping that in the end certain things can be mended. But lots of you are saying it can never be mended. <laughs> it's what the authorities be thinking. The reality is, is that they're thinking, well, hold on a minute. We put you together, but you ain't rehabilitated. You both still got some kind of violence in you. Hatred, that kind of stuff. No, 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 no. There's certain things that you can't just provoke, right? I'm not saying that they are, right? I'm not saying that they've provoked this, yeah? Um, the big man's trying to ring me at the time I'm doing this video, but I won't change it. But it hasn't gone really well at all, just to be honest. To be on, to be honest with you all, it hasn't gone really well. This one, right? And the aftermath, the clearing up, and the legality wranglings involved in all this are really going to be what we're going to get to the nitty gritty of all this. Um, but I'm hoping that it shouldn't interfere. Uh, with life on the outside. Maybe they learn from this bit. That, well, listen, it's too red hot. We're all just, call it a day. And you go your way and I'll go mine. Might be going live in a little bit. 